so I started out another vlog in the car again, but today is a special occasion. Today is Bae's birthday. I want everybody to get down in the comments and wish my babe D a happy birthday. You want me to get in the camera? Cool. <sighs> he said, hey, what's up, y'all? Um, but yeah, we're on our way to do a couple of things, get in these streets for his birthday. We're about to get ready to go to the movies right now. Um, I know we probably late on the train, but we want to go see Fast 9. And so, yeah, that's what's going on. Starting out the vlog, just wanted to come in and say, hey, you guys, um, what else? The July 11, 2021, everybody out there, go get y'all a free slurpee on me. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Oh yeah, because 7-Eleven gives out free Slurpees on 7-Eleven and that's basically, okay, forgot about that. <laughs> so yeah, y'all go get y'all free Slurpee on D. So uh, we're about to go ahead and head on to the movies, you guys, and I'll see you guys in a little bit. All right, guys, so we're out of the movies. Turn the radio down a little tab. So the movie was good. We enjoyed it. It was too much and too long, but it was still a good movie, nevertheless. What you think? So what we're about to do right now is we're about to go X throwing. Um, something we have never done before. I don't know what this is about to be like, but it's 3.40 in the afternoon. Our movie started at 12.30, so let, better let y'all know how long it was. The movie actually didn't even start till after one o'clock because of the previews. So it was like 30 minutes worth of previews. Yeah, I looked at the time on my phone. It was uh it was one it was twelve fifty five. So yeah, we about we have like a fifteen minute drive left to get to the axe throwing location. So once we get there check back in with y'all. We have the standard target, we have hit 10, which is zombies, we have tic-tac-toe, and we have the connect board. Just the standard target, yeah. And then so, uh, right here, these are the different rounds, right? Because you go down. Uh, oh. After every round, the target changes. Oh, okay. can go ahead and just uh, get a couple practice throws in, make sure you guys can get to state, and then you guys can start whenever. Do good, do great, and they talk bad on you. No mean, no face, cause they're not factual. I won't stay too long here, I'm just passing through. I might hit the bank and get a bag or two. My mama asked me why you got that cash room. Second you switch up, they might get mad at you. You're not my friend, so no, I'm taxing you. You are like my sons, I'm going dad on you. Okay, good job, good job. Get my no prop. Hit my line, you're irking me. I hit that woosa. No, I. Two. 
this out. Talk. Let me do it enough. Yeah, no, Mastermind yeah. this thing. But um, we have finished at the Axton place. It was such a good time, you guys. Like, I really, really recommend it. I'll put the information to the one that we went to. If you just so happen to be in the Garland Mesquite, Rockwall, Rowlett, Dallas type of area, then um, we went to the Grab Your Ex Axe Throwing. And it was such a really nice place. It's kind of like um, hard to find, but once you get there, it's a really nice time. The people are so nice and we had a super great time. So I'll put the information to the location that we went to down in the description box below. So what we're doing right now is we're at 7-Eleven because like I said, today is July 11. Today is Bay's birthday. So we're here at 7-Eleven getting his free small Slurpee for today for 7-Eleven for his birthday. So hope you guys have gotten your free Slurpee today on Bay. Next thing that's on the agenda is we should be going to go pick up our daughter. She's been at um, her cousin's house, Bay's brother, her uncle's house for quite a few days like three days three four days um but they're at a birthday party so we're trying to maximize this time that we have together and then we probably get her and then do something with her um to cap out the day it's like almost six o'clock so yeah it's been a real eventful day real chill yeah so let me let me put you guys over here back on the little thing So yeah, you guys, I really love these new lashes. Like I just got these on a whim from Walmart. These are from Salon Perfect or something like that. That's the Walmart brand and they're kind of like a winged. So yeah, these lashes are kind of like a winged and I really like them. I like them when they're shorter in the in the corner and then kind of flare out to like a bigger. Yeah, so I think these are gonna be my new go-to lashes. I think these are so cute on me. Let me know what y'all think. Hey guys, so it's the next day, Monday, and me and babe are both off of work today. So we about to have us like a little lunch date so i seen this place on instagram it was an instagram ad and they turn it turns out that they are local they were on featured on the dallas observer which is a real popular magazine for the dallas area that shows all the happening spots so we gonna try it out i'm gonna show you guys the menu see what the inside looking at looking like i don't know if we can eat inside and plus it's raining so we may just get our food to go um I don't know. We're going to see see what it's talking about. See what the inside looking like. It's for, I think it's a black owned establishment. So let's go ahead and go inside, you guys. Baby girl, let the 
please pray Give you all what your life is I know what I say Give me baby girl another night yeah. When you want something Come on you can ask and I never say no You know what I say Upgrade and nice I can get you some I met a girl from the UK Alright guys, so we just finished ordering. I'm gonna make this clip really short because as y'all can see, they got Michael playing in the background. So we just ordered our food. I got wings and babe got fish. And so we're gonna see what the food is talking about. She said it's gonna be worth the money because it was a little piece of change. So what you think about it? My job. Yeah, so y'all can see right here on the wall, they got a picture of how the wings are gonna look. So I'm just hoping that they're gonna look, and I asked for boneless, and I like my extra crispy, so we're gonna see, and back right here, that's a chicken sandwich. So we're gonna see what the food looking like. I'm so excited. We haven't had anything to eat today, so we gonna grub. <laughs> so, and I'm trying, and this is an adventure for us because babe, he normally don't eat places that he don't know about. So it's up to me to find all the, adventurous or new places for us to eat so we're gonna see what it's talking about so we'll check back in with y'all in a little bit all right so babe just got some fish and shrimp with lemon pepper seasoning on it and then it got fries and we all got like their kool-aid to drink so this is his food kool-aid yeah here's the kool-aid and then here's my daughter's food. She has the ATL wings, which is the buffalo wings with lemon pepper seasoning on them. Looks good. And we all got fries as well. And then last but not least, here is my food. So I have the, what did I get? <laughs> I got, oh, they didn't even put my stuff on there. So I got the um, Honey Hot Mama. And then I got the shoot i forgot it just i think it has ranch lemon pepper i think yeah lemon pepper and ranch or something like that i can't remember exactly what i got but if i can i'll look it up and then i'll put it across the screen and then i just got some mac and cheese fried mac and cheese just to try out and then we got fries so yeah let's taste it and see what it's talking about all right guys so verdict on the food i'm back in the car again as y'all can see verdict on the food is that it was pretty good um i wish we would have been able to eat there because of course traveling the place it's about 15 ish minutes away from our house so i wish traveling wise um they probably should have poked holes in the top of the containers because the food sweated a little bit but overall it was really good um babe said his fish was all right but i they have gotten a lot of really good reviews so i think it's worth a try to go back to try other things um yeah that's that on that what i'm about to do now is go to bath and body works you guys oh my gosh so SAS have been going on for a whole daggone month and I have not even gone once. Uh, that just shows y'all how my priorities have changed because I've been so focusing on looking at like patio furniture and stuff like that. Look at my wig. Do y'all like this new hair on me? It's a bob. Y'all are interested in the specs on this wig. I'll leave it down in the comment or in the description box for y'all to check out. It's from Amazon. It's from Bly Wigs. And I've seen other people do wig reviews on this brand. So maybe I should have done a wig video so they could sponsor me. <laughs> but uh, yeah, SAS have been going on for a month and I have not gone one time. So I'm about to go. Today is the very last day. Today is July, July 12th. Today is the very last day of Bath and Body Works Summer Semi-Annual Sale. And we going. This thing keep, let me see if that does it. Uh, so yeah, we're going. 
y'all coming with me uh probably not interested in getting any body care i'm just ready for the fall to take place like and i feel like i'm more into like the fall fragrances and like spring and summer i feel like i need more masculine scents like cologne scents cologne cologne type scents so yeah that's the vibe i'm on it's 4 30 in the afternoon and i thought i was going to be able to go ahead and make my way here before any traffic really started happening but turns out i'm in the thick of it i'm in the thick of it <laughs> so yeah um let me focus on the road while i'm in this rush hour traffic and then i'll see you guys at bath and body works I put on my jewelry just to go to the bodega And I keep it with me just so that I'm feeling safer and It's a whole lot of money in this mouth Alright guys, so I made it I haven't been to this location in quite some time The last time, I think over a year actually Because they had closed down to do some remodeling So it's going to be my first time in this location since I have been here in over here since they did the remodeling, so let me go ahead and go in and show y'all what's going down. Thank you. Hello. Hello. Yes. Do you have a puppy sign? No, I'm just looking around. Would you like to turn it with a vlog on? Yeah, I will in a second. Oh, you already have it. <laughs> good let me know if y'all have tried the honey wildflower so i'm gonna switch over to uh music because y'all can hear the music playing so this looks a lot different it's way bigger so see y'all you guys I'm at TJ Maxx so
So I'm back at home. I'm going to show y'all what I got from TJ Maxx. I probably should have took this stuff out of the bag before I started recording, but here we go. And y'all can see my Bath and Body Works bags right there. I'm going to wait to do that. So, because I know there's some people out there who have subscribed to my channel just for like my Bath and Body Works videos. And I realized that I haven't done a Bath and Body Works video in quite some time. So I'm going to make my last day of SAS and what I got a different video. So I'm going to do that as a haul. But let me show y'all what I got. I just got two things. Um, I have this purse right here. This is a Jessica Simpson purse. I needed a black purse. I don't have a small black purse um handbag so i saw this one and i thought this was kind of cute um it just has like the gold not really studs or like beads around it it has the gold hardware just for simpson and then it has this like cheetah leopard print on the inside lots of compartments which is good so yeah, it's a small purse, but it can hold a lot of stuff. So here's all the compartments, y'all can see. And then the strap is really long too, so I can wear it as a crossbody. Like, really long strap. It just has like this um, leaf-like clamp detailing right here. And then it just says Jessica Simpson as well. Really cute purse. I was thinking about the fall, like I don't have a black purse. So just went ahead and picked this up and it was $24.99, I believe. Yes, it was $24.99. And then the only other thing that I got was these kitchen utensils that I just saw when I was on the line. And it's a three pack of 10 and a half inch tongs. I needed these just for like cooking and stuff, of course. And they were $7.99. So yeah, that was the only thing that I picked up from TJ Maxx. And y'all stay tuned for the haul on my Bath and Body Works stuff. Hey guys, so I'm gonna make this clip real short. So this was kind of a last minute thing. Uh, Destiny and her friend wanted to go to a king stay on this side of town, so I'm gonna let them stay for like a couple of hours and then we're gonna head home. But in the meantime, me and mom are gonna just hang out and probably have us a couple of drinks here at this restaurant called Boomer Jack. Hi. Hi. Yeah. Hi. All right, it's two. I'm waiting on. I'm waiting on. You're not in there. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 